Hey guys, it's Jackie and I thought I would go ahead and start the, I don't know what just fell. Oh, the lid. I thought I would go ahead and start, where's the lighting? Um, the filming process of the moving process, okay? Um, so right now I'm actually organizing Joe's clothes. We had it inside this bin right here. Don't mind the mess. Um, but I am, I got these vacuum sealed bags from the 99 cent store for only $3.99. And I am going to vacuum seal his clothes in these bags, just so I can use this bin for something else. Um, but yeah, so that's what I'm doing right now. I'm sorting his clothes. I am getting rid of clothes that have armpit stains on them or clothes that I know he will not wear. I'm so out of focus. Um, but yeah, so that's what I'm doing right now. So we're gonna do that right now. And then I went to Pop Shelf today and I'm gonna show you guys what I got from there. let me tell you guys what I mean about armpit stains look how bad this is this is an armpit stain it's so bad okay so currently these are all the shirts that have armpit stains and stuff like that on them I don't know why his shirts get so bad armpit stains I don't know but these are the clothes we're keeping okay y'all so I just packed all of his clothes in here the only thing that I didn't fit in here was his socks so I don't know what I'm gonna do about his socks but everything else his shirts shorts pants underwears all of that's in here so now we're gonna vacuum seal it and I'm so scared for some reason but we're gonna do it so I have my vacuum cleaner right here this is so heavy I hope it works um so I think I take, take this off right yeah open open close okay and then I take this, take this, and I put it here. I wonder if I would have laid it down, would it have flattened it more? I don't know. But it's like, it's sealed, bro. This thing is sealed. <laughs> okay, so now this box is empty. So what I think I'm going to do with this box is I'm going to try to pack as much of the stuff over here. This is basically like all new stuff that I bought in that corner in that box. And I'm going to try to pack as much as I can into this box. So that's what we're going to do right now. So I took a little break because my camera was dying and I need to charge it. It's been charging for like an hour now. Um, it is currently like 5.42 at the moment. And I'm going to go ahead and continue this packing process. So I think I'm going to repack some things. Because I had already packed like three boxes of stuff. But I think I'm going to take out some stuff and try to put it in this bin here. With this stuff, like this black bin, I think I'm going to designate for like kitchenware. So I think I'm going to put like a lot of the kitchen stuff in here if it fits. Um, and then I'm going to take the towels with that box. And I think I'm going to put the towels and the... What's it called? The bathroom rug inside a vacuum sealed bag. I think that would be a good idea. So that's what I'm going to do right now. And I'm also going to take out the skillets, the dishes, and some dishes my mom had bought me. And I'm going to repack them with bubble wrap and dish wrap and paper. Um, and try to put them in this box. Um, because like I could keep them in the boxes, but I feel like it'd just be safer if I wrap them up and stuff. Instead of keeping them in the box also if y'all have questions on why I'm packing this early I honestly don't feel like it's early I'm a very like I want to get things done I'm gonna get it done as soon as I can so that's why I'm packing this early um also like I don't want to stress myself out the closer we get to Joe's graduation day um will I be moving right away with him most likely not I probably will have to wait a couple weeks before I can move with him um until he gets um leave to come back over here and help me move if possible 
but yeah so i know it's not going to be like an instant thing where i'm like literally the day after he graduates i'm going to be going with him it's not going to be like that and i know that and i know people are going to tell me that but i like to be prepared and i like to have all of this done already because i don't want to stress myself out the closer i get to there the closer i get to his graduation i want to be mellowed out i want to be stress-free as i can and i want to enjoy the time i have with him instead of worrying about packing shit up you know what i'm saying so that's what i'm doing i'm gonna show you guys real quick what i got from pop shelf before i forget and before i pack it up so let me show you guys what i got from pop shelf they did have a sale on their valentine's stuff and i grabbed some valentine's things from their valentine section how many times can i say valentine's so i'm not a big valentine's person but this stuff was cute and it's not like too valentine's-y and i'm gonna use it for like everyday decor so first thing i got is this heart sign heartwood sign i may i might stain it i might write her last name on it who knows i feel like there's so many possibilities with this originally five dollars and i think everything was around five dollars but i got it for like a dollar something everything was like a dollar something nothing over a dollar nothing over two dollars i should say i got two of these hearts they're like uh ceramic i was gonna say glass ceramic hearts it says tabletop decor but i think you could use these for like anything um this would be cute for just like decoration um also not valentine's Day. it's white and it's cute and originally five dollars got it for like a dollar something my room is a disaster right now guys like i'm pretty sure y'all guys saw like i have stuff everywhere and it's driving me crazy this is exactly why i like packing stuff as well because i hate like just having stuff everywhere it makes my mind crazy i got this this was not on sale but it is a treats kind of canister um i'm gonna put bowser's treats on here um this was full price five dollars still think that's a good deal for something like this um but yeah it's metal next thing i got is this like little vase kind of like thing um it says forever on it it's like a little house i don't really know but i thought it was cute and it was originally three dollars got it for like a couple cents or a dollar or something so my mom actually got this for me but it's like a little football like charcuterie board cutting board thing but it's definitely yeah it's a charcuterie board so like when we like host football games or something like that um this is something that we're definitely gonna be using it's just super cute my mom also got me two packs of these um towel sets Oop. they're like this like light gray color and these were ten dollars each it's a six piece bath set it comes with two bath towels two hand towels and two washcloths now i personally cannot being plus size i cannot wrap a basic bath towel on me but joe would be able to use these i have to buy like the specialty like extra large bath towels um so i'm gonna have to buy me like another one because i have one already but i'm gonna have to buy probably another one i'm not sure yet though i got a couple random things i got bowser a hairbrush i got some gummy vitamins which are already opened i got some valentine's chocolate that was on sale which i really shouldn't be drinking chocolate because look at this right here look at that i know you see it i know you see it and it's making me mad because i hate it but yeah i think that's everything i got from pop shelf today i'm gonna go ahead and get started on what i need to get started on because i need to get this sorted out okay okay guys so i have my little station set up right here i'm going to be packing up the dishes um that we have um so basically i basically had to unpack the whole box that i just packed up in the beginning um so i could rearrange everything um and try to make as much fit as possible um i also rewrapped some stuff and i started to label them so like if it's a plate it's gonna say plate if it's a mixing bowl so mixing bowl um etc 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 so i'm gonna go ahead and start packing these dishes and i'll just fast forward this for you guys <laughs> I keep messing up I forgot I had this dish wrap oh my god I'm so dumb So what 
what I think I'm gonna do with the plates is I'm gonna keep this box and I'm just gonna rewrap them because this wrapping isn't doing it for me. So I'm gonna take off this wrapping that they came with. Ooh. And I'm going to rewrap it with the dish wrap paper I have. By the way, guys, I got all of this packing material off of Facebook Marketplace, like a whole box full of it for five bucks. And that is a steal because packing material is not cheap. So if you ever need packing material, I look on Facebook because half the time you'll find it. So what I'm doing is I'm going to put a piece down and then I'm going to put one on top, piece down, one on top, and then another piece. One more, like so, and then I'm gonna wrap them. I'll probably wrap it like twice. Also, guys, I'm not a professional packer. My mom got me these from Burlington. It's a bake set, glass bake set. She got this for $12.99. I'm not gonna keep this stuff in the box because it's just like extra material and stuff that I feel like we don't need. Okay guys, so I was able to fit a majority of stuff in there. I think I wasn't able to fit, what I wasn't able, I wasn't able to fit the coffee jar, the pug statue, which isn't even kitchen, but it was in one of the other boxes, and um, a saucepan. I was able to fit basically all the main dishes and stuff in there, and um, yeah, I was basically like Tetris. So I'm going to go ahead and try to put the lid on now. Oh, I hope this goes on. Mmm, I don't think it's going to go on, guys. Oh my god. This side goes on, this side doesn't. What's keeping it from going? I need to finesse it, you know what I'm saying? We need to finesse just a little bit. So I might, it closes. I just need to tape it instead of snap it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my packing tape and I'm gonna tape the sides right here. Just to tape it shut, you know what I'm saying? Okay, so I did get it taped. Now I'm just gonna reorganize the boxes and stuff over here. So on the side of one of these tapes, I'm just gonna put dishes for right now. Let me put this box up here. Okay, so I'm gonna take a break real quick again. Charge my battery a little more. I'm gonna go eat something. And yeah, because I've been at this for what now? I've been at this for an hour, guys. It's 6.32. Um, so I'm gonna take a break and then I will be back. You see, this is why you pack early. Because if you don't pack early, you see how long that took me just to do that little bit? Like, oh my god, like I'm already stressed out. <laughs> so <laughs> I'm gonna go eat and then I'll be back. Okay, let me explain what I'm doing now. I have this little thing over here, this little dresser thing. I cleaned up already the boxes and stuff. And I'm going through this bottom drawer because this is where I had all of Joe's stuff. At. All that's in there are travel makeup bags and stuff like that. Um, and I'm going to need those for when we go to Missouri when he graduates. So I got some Ziploc baggies here. And I'm going to put basically all of this stuff that's his in there. Um, I'm pretty sure he's not going to need any of this stuff. Um, which is like his pills. And, um, I have pregnancy tests, ovulation tests, and stuff like that. Because I'll probably get into that in another video. But we are trying to conceive. We've been trying to conceive for, for a while now. 
um, and fingers crossed it happens, you know what I'm saying? Um, this is stuff we actually got him for Christmas when my parents got him. This, because my, like I said, my husband's obsessed with lions. This is our going to be our first magnet, so that's cute. Um, I got him this. It's a lion coin. Um, so the Lion of Judah. Um, so this is his company that he's in. He is a Delta War Dog. And my parents got him a koozie maid. And then on the back is our last name and then pictures of us. This is the day we got married. And this is the day before he left um, to training. But yeah, that's like all the little gifts that he got for Christmas that is in this box. So I'm going to go ahead and pack that stuff away. His headphones and stuff. I think I'm going to leave his headphones out. And I'm going to pack his colognes too. I'm going to wrap those up in paper as well. And then I have already packed up another box. This is basically all the decor and stuff that I bought today. And then the stuff that didn't fit in there. So, yeah. And it's almost full. It could fit a little more in there. So, I'm trying to fit this in there. I also vacuum sealed his socks. They fit perfectly in the medium size bag. So, all of his socks are in there. He has so many socks. He should not complain that there's no socks. Um, and then I'm going to, after I'm done with this... I'm going to vacuum seal the towels and yeah and then I'm going to go through the closet. I don't know if I want to do that today. You know I don't need to get everything done in one day. That's what I'm trying to tell myself. I don't need to get everything done in one day. So <laughs> I'm going to finish doing this and then I will update you guys when I'm done. Okay guys so I'm fixing to vacuum seal the bathroom stuff now. The only thing I don't have is a shower curtain like a decorative shower curtain um that you put over the liner i think I'm, it doesn't matter <laughs> i just want to vacuum seal the stuff and get out of the way if i need to i could just unvacuum seal and then stuff when i get the decorative curtain okay so i'm gonna show you guys real quick um we have the bath rug i got this from the dollar tree actually from the dollar and more spot it was five dollars it's a really nice rug um these are the towels that i got from walmart so I got two regular ones and then I got a big one for me because I'm a big bitch. Okay. <laughs> and then these are the towels my mom got me today. I think I'm going to take them out of the the wrapping. And then I have the aligner that goes with the shower. I'm going to put everything in there and then I'm going to vacuum seal it. And then I think that's all I'm going to do today. And then I'll clean off my bed and stuff i went ahead and taped up that box already that i was packing oh here's a better look at the vacuum seal bags that i'm using so here's a better look at them this is what they're called they're called smart bags um yeah they were only 3.99 which is such a good deal um so yeah it comes with two medium two large and one extra large so after I'm done with this, I'm going to have one large bag left. No, I'm going to have the extra large bag left and the one medium bag left. And I'm going to use the extra large bag when I go through my closet and get out like our winter blankets and stuff like that. Um, but I'm going to do that a different day because I don't want to stress myself out tonight. Um, it's already it's already 7-11 as you guys could see. That's a good amount of time I've been working on this. You know what I'm saying? I got a good amount done. And Joe's going to be like, oh my god, you've packed that much already? Yes, honey, I've packed this much already because, like, I just don't want to stress about it later. Because I'm already stressing about it, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Which is not good. It's not good for me to stress, but I'm stressing. Anyways, um, after I'm done packing all of this up, I really don't have much to pack up. All that's really left to pack up for me after this is all done is, like, if I buy anything extra which i don't plan to buy anything else except for like big stuff like i plan to still buy like a crock pot i still plan to buy there was this mixer i was looking at as well from the drew barrymore line that's also where i want to buy like the crock pot from was from the drew barrymore line from walmart because i think they're so pretty and they're also not expensive surprisingly so I, I plan to buy those two things and i think that's really all i plan to buy in a toaster that's all and the toaster is not even important so i don't really care to buy the toaster we could buy that when we get to where we get um but yeah and then you know the closet's really already packed up i packed up joe's stuff actually right now trash bags so you can't really see because there's the lighting sucks in here but i put his stuff in trash bags so his clothes are like they're hung up but they're in trash bags you know what i'm saying um 
and then those are like his cowboy boots and stuff like that and then all of those boxes up there are for like my computer stuff um so yeah basically all that needs to be packed up are clothes computer stuff shoes um and that's really all to be honest and then the stuff on the shelf and i packed up our wedding box that held our cards and i packed up um the jewelry box that was holding some stuff i am going to go over what he wants to keep out of our wall stuff we're definitely keeping that because we just got that for christmas we're probably going to keep that i don't know if i want that baby grogu poster anymore we just got this as well so we're keeping that we're keeping this I don't know if I want to keep her to be honest I don't know if I want to keep her I believe we're keeping these we're keeping this one and we're keeping this one but we're not keeping this one and then I think we're keeping this he wants to keep this I think but I don't know and then we're keeping that and then he wants to keep this I think we're keeping this as well I feel like we're keeping so much I really do want to start new and have like this like I said like newness to wherever we go whether it be on base or off base i want it to be like i want us to feel like adults and be adults i don't want to have all of this childish stuff still with us not saying that if you have this stuff in your house you're childish obviously we have it in our room right now um and this is stuff we love we love superheroes we love gaming we love stuff like that but it's just like do we want that in our our home you know like i don't know but i feel like either way like we're most likely going to be able to get a two bedroom home or apartment or whatever like i said and we're going to make one of those rooms a gaming room um or a streaming room slash guest room and i feel like we could put like all of like the like non-adultish non-adultish like all of these posters and stuff in that room um and that could be like our just like our, what do they call it pop culture room because I don't know if I want all of that stuff in like the living room and like stuff like that and I also like I have this like vision for our bedroom and this stuff is not in my vision you know what I'm saying um so I'm definitely gonna talk about, talk to him about that tomorrow um but yeah thinking about it like I really don't have much to pack after I'm done with this stuff um it's really just my crap that I need to pack up, you know what I'm saying? And I think I'm actually, like, I don't wear any of these clothes in this bin. I never look in there. I haven't looked in that bin in months. And I don't wear anything in there. I might go through it one more time. Like, I might go through my closet one more time. I'll go through this one more time. And then I'm going to go through the dishes. We have dishes that we have bought in the kitchen. Of, uh, like, coffee mugs and stuff like that. I'm going to go through that one more time. Because we are having a garage sale during spring break when my mom's off of work. Because I want her here when I do it. Because I'm not going to run a garage sale by myself. But, yeah. So, we're going to be doing that. And I just need to declutter, like, one more time. And then I'll be content and happy and not stressed. <laughs> so, yeah. And then, like, I love my Squishmallows as well. I want to talk about this, too. I love my Squishmallows. I love them. I love sleeping with them. Joe loves sleeping with them, even though he may deny it. He loves sleeping with them. And they're so comfy. But I think I'm going to limit myself to only bring, like, three with me. I'm only going to limit myself to bring three with me. I think I have about, right now, like, six or seven. And I'm going to limit myself to bring three. The rest are probably going to either go to my mom, because my mom's like, I want them. And then the garage sale, so. Or be donated. So there is that. I'm going to vacuum seal this stuff now and stop talking and then that is going to be all for today.